chai latte and Georgie's puppuccino. There it is, on his nose. So it's uh, a lovely sunny day in Boston, and apparently the tide is going out, so we're going to Skegness. We're going to take the train and go visit the uh, romping grounds of Joe's dad when he was young. So that'll be fun. I have no idea what's there, but apparently there's a beach. And there'll be a happy doggy. <laughs> Is it dead? Well, it's where I keep having it explained to everybody. Um, it's not dead. Yeah, it's a moon jelly, and it's drifted in up onto the shore. I found a few of them. This one's the most intact of them. That's why I thought I'd bring it to you to show you. Yeah, it's not dead. I mean, it's dead. Well, it's not exactly dead. It's like death for a jellyfish is kind of harder to think of than for a human. <laughs> um, it's still got, this is its stomachs and its reproductive system is still intact. It's lost most of its tentacles because it's been pushed up onto the shore. It's got its mouth visible here. You know, it does have some of the remaining tentacles and it can regenerate like a starfish and stuff if it's got food. Problem is whether or not it's got anything in there to regenerate with. And it'd have to get out into deep water because once it blows up on the shore, it'll just get up there and then it'll desiccate. And once it's desiccated, then yeah, it's dead. But, you know, fundamentally, they don't work like us, so. You're going to set it free. Yeah, I'm going to toss it back in there. Thought I'd let you try and I'm touch it. it. You're not touching it? It's too it's googly. Ooh. <laughs> they feel neat. They feel really neat. They're like, it's just protein and water, essentially, right? But it just turns into this fascinating structure and, yeah. And I've had to tell a whole bunch of people that, no, in fact, they can't kill you. Because, like, there are jellyfish on the planet that can kill you. They're in Australia, primarily. And uh, they're extremely rare uh, anywhere outside of the tropics. Yeah, that's the other one. Not all of them. Well, these ones are a type of jellyfish that can't really sting you or anything. So, but this is the one I tried to throw out and get out into the water, and I can't get them deep enough. That's the problem. I can get the tennis ball deeper. How the kids like, are you allowed to hold them? I'm allowed to hold them. I don't know if you're allowed to hold them. Yeah, Skegness is cool. Well, Skegness is Skegness. It's really hot, actually. It's, it's fairly warm, yeah. But, you know, there's jellyfish floating up onto the shore. There's some sort of spawning happening in the water, so there's little wormy things. Um, good luck to everybody that went deeper than I did. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, George has been having a ball, Thanks, literally. <laughs> Although, we lost his ball and his chucker, so I had to walk back into town to get three balls, and I've had to improvise a chucker, which is not working right now. But if I can get it, right, if I can get it. Right.
Over there, so. It's over there.